Hey guys, it's weekly paycheck time. Tomorrow I get paid. It'll be the typical 370. Next week will be a little bit more. So uh, let's go ahead and jump in. Last week I forgot to do the video, so you missed a paycheck, which is fine. But let's go ahead and jump into this, and I'm going to show you everything that I'm planning to do with my paycheck this week. I'm going to go and do my nails and my toes tomorrow. I'm not going to do a wax this time. I just don't really feel like I need it. Um, so it's probably going to be less than $80, but just in case I put $80 there for that and it leaves us with $290. Then I have a doctor appointment to get a referral to get back in with the endocrinologist since my appointment got canceled within the doctor was out sick. So I couldn't get in. Um, and I also need to get a referral for speech therapy. Um, and I owe them a little bit of money, not much, like $50. So every time I've been going, I've been paying them $10 to pay that little bit of debt off. Then my grandparents' birthday is this month, and we're having the fish fry with them on September 28th, I believe. But I won't have Cooper, so I'm going to go ahead and go this weekend, and we're either going to get some cupcakes and a cookie cake, or a cookie cake, and some pizza and that's what i'm gonna bring to them we're gonna have lunch with them and then i'll get them a gift when it comes time for their actual fish fry for their actual birthday but we're just gonna do it early with the boys so they can both have time to visit and enjoy some pizza and cupcakes or cookie cake whatever we decide to do i'm gonna go ahead and put 25 dollars in the household i may need more which i have that there fluctuating just in case then I'm going to put $30 into Mason's birthday fund to finish, like, start finishing off his birthday party. And that leaves us with, I think, $200 even. So I'm going to put $50 into Christmas to start building that up because I have specific things I still want to buy for the boys. And that'll leave us with $150 for gas or whatever else we need this week. I don't have to pay for daycare this week because I am kid-free this week. So it left me with a little bit of extra money to budget. I hope y'all enjoyed this budget video and I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.